Hey guys, so we're going to be doing another cool magic trick that you would really like to show your friends. It's, it's called the three piles. So I think we should get on to it then. So firstly, what you want to do is try and... I'm going to try and find a prediction card, but you can't see it, so I'm just going to hide it from the camera. And I'm going to find a prediction card. Just any random card. And I'm going to put it down on the table next to me. So, you guys won't be able to see that card. So, now what I'm going to do is I'm going to make three piles. E try to make it equally. And now, so after um, I'm going to do that. And now, I'm going to turn over the top cards of each of the pile. So, I've got a queen, an eight, and a five. So, the queen counts as ten because it's a picture card. So, I'm just going to do that and then put two on each of the remaining piles. So, I'm going to count out the 10. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Put 2 on each. Then I'm going to count out the 8. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 1, and 2. Now, finally, the 5. So, I'm just going to do that. Um, that will be 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 1 on each. So now we're going to reveal the prediction card. So the prediction card was the seven of clubs. But what I've done is I found all of the sevens in the pack. The seven of spades, the seven of hearts and the seven of diamonds. So moving on to the tutorial. So what you'll need is a five and all the sevens. So, but I'm also you're going to need three random cards. So I'm just going to pick three off the top. It's a jack, a two, and a three. So what you're going to do first is you're going to get a five and put that on top of all three random cards. So it should be the five and then your three random cards. Then you're going to take three sevens and you can leave any, it doesn't matter which one. And you put them and your, deck out, your layout should be that. And then... You put that at the top of the deck, and then you just slot your seven in wherever you want. <coughs> Excuse me. And then then after that, it just works on from there. So you say you're going to pr pick out a prediction card. You find the other seven in the pack, and you pick it out like you're just going, oh, let me just pick out a random card. So you put then you put it on the table where they can't see. And then you make the three piles. So you get it equally, try and make it equally. So you get one, and then you keep the five there at the top. Then you make the two, the second, and the third. Then you turn over all the top cards, and the five should always be there when, in every trick, it should always be there if it's at the top. So then you count out two, one, two, and then one on each. Then you count out the jacks, so that would be... One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Then one on each, and then finally, I'm ju I'm gonna just quickly sorting them out, neaten them. So I'll just neaten out the first, and then the second, and then the third, and then so when you do the five, you just have to try to remember, just remember to put the two cards, and it should work on from there. One, two, three, four, five, and then one on each. So then you just say to the spectator, I'm just gonna turn over card it's the seven or oh, what a surprise then you turn over all of them and you say look what i've done i've made all the sevens appear so thanks guys see ya